All right, today we're gonna to be going over the straight ankle lock. So we're gonna start in the double guard pull situation. So basically I wanna, I'm gonna shoot my leg through and I want my foot on his hip with my knee, I mean my arm heel on his hip and my toes pointed out. Now this leg, traditional like schools, they teach the hook under here and get your knees tight like this. It's good starting off, I guess it's okay, but the problem is when you start getting more advanced and heel hooks are involved, once I fall to the side for my straight ankle lock, I'm leaving my heel exposed for him to pull and heel hook me. So come a little closer to the seat, do it again. He can heel hook me right here. So to avoid that, what I want to do is when I get this here, I'm getting my knees tight, but my foot right here, you come a little closer, my foot right here is hooking this opposite leg hooking his leg, so I'm still tight and everything, but it's hooked, so now he doesn't have that heel hook. So, when I get in my, my position, I'm hooking over here, got everything tight, I get under here, now I want his knee facing that way, but my knees to face the same way as his, so I can, when I fall to the side, I'm gonna push his knees. I need to finish the arm straight ankle lock, I need his knees to be facing the same way. If it's facing up, it's not gonna work. So I need it straight here. Now once I use my hand to push his knee that way, and I have this choked up under, my goal is to get as high as possible on the ankle, which is right here, the Achilles. And I want that blade of my forearm. So I'm underneath here, I fall to my side, control it here, and I'm just gonna choke up a little bit till I can get real high. Now I want my hand on my chest. I don't want it all the way down here stretching back. I want my hand, tight as I can on my chest. Now, I can get this grip, which is the basic grip, or I can get this grip. Doesn't really matter. Then once I get it, I'm just gonna fall, not to my, on my shoulder, but fall, try to fall as much as I can on the front of my shoulder. And then I'm crunching up like a ball. Now notice, I'm not like this, trying to finish it. I'm tight, and I'm using this to push off his hip, so I'm pushing off and I'm pulling. And I get the tap. So you notice I wasn't all, all the way back like that. So here, lock it up, knees always tight, trapping the leg. Come under, as I fall, I'm falling and pushing. Here, everything's tight, he's trapped. I can keep the control so his knees still pointing out there, choke up a little bit, get my hand as much as I can to my chest, I can get here, or I can get here, fall like this. Try to fall to the front of my shoulder, and I curl up, and then I just start going backwards till I get the tap, all right? And it's different grips, like I said, you can get this grip, you can get this grip, or you can shoot it through and get this grip. This is real tight right here. So a lot of times what I like to do, this grip is good, but I like to get deep here, or I shoot this through and get here. So a real cool drill to drill all three of them is you go here, here, here. Just get used to training all three, all three, all right? So try that.